Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 2. Uh, Resident Evil 2, there we go again, told you it would get me. Uh, Resident Evil 3, when we last left off we were exploring the last few areas of the police station, uh, which I think there's only one other area we can explore now. And it's through here. We dealt with Nemesis as well, and we got the STI Eagle, which is pretty fucking wicked. It's one of my favourite games. Uh, one of my favourite games. One of my favourite guns in this game. Yeah, there's a lot of brain munches in here, from what I can remember. Uh, yeah, they're pretty far away, though, so we're not going to worry about them too much. Let's check out this room. See what's going on in here. Anybody? Ooh. Okay, the stars card. That looks like Jill's card as well. You've taken the stars card. Hmm. An ID card. The stars with Jill's picture on it. Interesting. All right, well, we're certainly going to hold on to that. Now, it would be nice if there's some ammo or something in here, but I don't think there is. Um, let's have a quick gander. Uh, there is an ink room there, but no. As much as uh, I want to pick it up, uh, we're not going to. Because, you know, waste of uh, item space and all that. Now, is there any, like, bullets or anything here? No? Savage. Okay, what about in this room? Uh, of course. Well, I don't know, because that puzzle hasn't been done yet, so... Is this before or after Leon's adventure? Hard to say. Okay, well, let's get out of here. Uh, let's take the shotgun just in case. Just in case there's any dodgy zombies out here that want to have a go. Now, where are they? Yeah. Yeah, there's one or two. Ugh. Well, we'll get rid of him. Yeah, looks like there's still like three of them coming. Yeah, let's see if we can go for a double. Oh, come on. Yeah, that's kind of not going to work, Chief. But it is what it is. Let's just have a little look around this corner. You know what? We'll eat that. That's fine. I guess we will hold on to our... Oh, there's... Wait, were they missing or not? I actually can't remember. Damn my poor abused brain. Yeah, she readies this gun really quick. Can we? Oh, see, that's the thing. You can't even see. You can't even see what's going on there. That's fine. Okay, so I think we're pretty much done with this. Unless something happens when we use this star card, stars card, which possibly. <laughs> Let's go have a look. Now, I very much doubt I'm going to complete this game um, before I actually go through the whole thing myself because uh, I do actually have holiday coming up. I've got five days left at work, uh, which starts tomorrow. Yay. Although at the time of this recording, I'll probably be half... Well, by the time this gets uploaded, I'll probably be halfway through that. Um, so we'll see how that goes. And then I'll be on holiday, so I'm probably gonna probably gonna try and complete this off camera, just so it gives me a little bit more knowledge of what's going on. Really, Jill, don't be a nemesis. She's like getting stuck. Let's use the star card. Will this drop the ladder? Maybe. Choose the emergency. Yeah. Oh right, no, I remember why we why we can get that. Yeah, that has nothing to do with, um, oh, we can't do anything here. Yeah, that has nothing to do with anything. That's basically, if you don't stop and fight Nemesis, if you run away from Nemesis, you can still get the card without going outside. I remember. But we used Brad's card, so it's all gravy, baby. Now, we need to go uptown, I believe, thereabouts. So if we have a little look on our map here. Oh, this is Uptown. Ah. Right. 
Do we have the lockpick on us? Because, yeah. Uh, we might need that. Okay. Well, let's get back to the item box anyway. Drop our herbs back. For now. There are those doggos in there. We need to put that fire out too. And there's something that we possibly need. I uh, don't really want to fight the doggos if we don't have to. It just seems like a waste of money and resources at this point, to be honest. Um, right. Uh, yeah, videos this week might be uh, a little bit chaotic in their uploads. Hmm. Let's take those shotgun shells. And combine. Yeah, might as well use that up. I guess we'll put the stars card back because we can't like ever use that now. And we don't need these either. Uh actually. What's going on up here? Oh yeah, we've got that's right, we actually have a somewhat decent amount of health, I suppose. Um where is the lockpick? There's the lockpick. Okay, we'll take that. We'll take the lockpick. Let's go. Let's go have a little look. See why that door is locked. Hey, doggo. I'm not going to cause you trouble if you don't cause me trouble. That's the deal. Now, where's that? So we can go down here, can't we? We can. Ah, uh, it was the lockpick. I thought it was. I mean, it kind of has to be. It's like the only item that we possibly could have been. Right. Have an explosive barrel. Ah, hello, friend. Ooh, that's a brain sucker. We're going to take the handgun bullets, absolutely. He's holding something else as well. Mercenary's diary. September 1st. Following six months of intensive training, my body... My body's edge has returned. I was a good soldier. But later they ordered my execution with no reason given. Ugh. Iffy. I was tortured and forced to give a false confession. But on the morning of my execution, a miracle happened. The company had helped me out, giving me a second lease on life. September 15th. I ended my vacation short. Sounds a strange way of saying it. Uh, and return to the HQ office. It looks like my UBCS unit has been called into action. Umbrella maintains its work, um, its own paramilitary unit to counter corporate terrorism and VIP abduction. In addition, they have nightmen who specialize in handling problems caused by illegal products. I'm currently a member of the latter. September 28th, dawns here. But we're still slogging through this nightmare. There are no provisions of any kind here. The undead walk the streets feeding upon the flesh of the living. Giving the choice again, I would rather have been executed. Death Row was a heavenly asylum compared to this place. I've chosen to pull the trigger on myself in the hope that my dead body won't come back to life. Oh. Oh dear. Yeah, in the interest of saving time as well, I might do 20 minute videos for this week. Might have to if I want to get all my videos done. Because tomorrow I could potentially use for a recording day, but I have to go and house it. So, ah. Yeah, I think we need a wrench for this, don't we? Memory serves me. There's a fire hydrant. A fire hose is affixed with bolts. That's it. Yeah, we need the wrench. Interesting. Let's keep going. Ah, there's some herbs here, some blue ones. Yeah, we'll take them. I suppose we can always uh, go back to an item box. Isn't this close to where we get a side pack anyway? Memory serves. Let's go back. Yeah, if I don't cut my video length down uh, this week, uh, I won't be able to make enough videos for the whole week. Ooh. We've got some commotion. Interesting. Well, let's go put these doges down. Oh, that was... Oh, great. I mean, fine. We'll take that. Really? Wow, you, you can't kind of, like, pin them down like you could in Resident Evil 2. Or maybe I'm just... 
maybe I've just lost my edge. I'm getting the feeling that I've lost my edge on this playthrough. Wow. That's looking pretty nasty. Nothing here. Nothing especially strange here. Yeah, this is all pretty standard stuff. I mean, you know, smashed city. Fine. Oh, hey, dog. Pretty sure. Yeah. Oh, critical hit. That's what I was talking about. We will take the gunpowder. Gunpowder bill. Uh, B. Gunpowder. <laughs> yeah, words. Words are difficult. Gunpowder B. He was apparently bitten in the neck until he died. Yeah, apparently so. Alright. Anyway, let's keep going. Yeah, we got more dogs in here. These dogs kind of suck. Large quantities of penis. We can also take... Yes, we can take this, but we can't because... Our inventory is full. Due to me having all the foresight in the world, it seems that there is no power for it. Okay, well, does that mean... Okay, fine. As long as we stay away from the dogs, they should be okay. And as long as we don't panic them by running. Jill, you're not listening to me. Uh, we, they should be pretty passive. Oh yeah, cool. That's fine. Find ourselves back into a, a lovely, a lovely save room. Ah, oh, sweet goodies. So, let's drop these herbs down. Now the... what? kind of i find a little bit misleading on this though is green uh, or blue herbs i should say actually highlight is green but i mean I, I guess they're healing items but not really i can't remember where we need to use well no i do know where we need to use that but i can't remember when we get to it uh we'll keep that on us suppose we can go back and get the cords uh Let's group all of our weapons up as well. Like we always do. Uh, really? I swear there's like a little bit of input delay with this. Not a lot, but it's there. Right. Cool. There we go. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Right. So we've got a shotgun with plenty of rounds and we have our pistol. Cool. Now, is there anything else? Oh, go on, we'll take that. Just. Yeah. No! Don't insult me with your bloody ink ribbon shenanigans. Is there nothing there, really? Alright. Well, okay, we'll go back and we'll see if we can get those cords. Because I know we need those to repair the uh, tram. Hey, Doji. You just be cool, alright? You be cool, and I'll be cool, we'll all be cool. No need for any tomfoolery. Stay away from me, and I'll stay away from you. It'd be awful if I had to put you down there, wouldn't it? Well, would it? I mean, they are zombie dogs. Yep, we shall have the power cable. Excellent. That'll do. Ah, oh, that was us. to be honest. They should go uh, passive again, I think, when we come back in here. Memory serves. I think that's how it works. Could be wrong. Been wrong before. And I'll be wrong again. Should have dropped those power cables back, but it's fine. Ooh. Oh, okay, so these dogs start aggressive. That's wonderful. There's grenade rounds in there, I think. But we can't use them yet. In that door. Pretty sure there's a zombie that bursts out of that cop car. Oof, okay. We'll take the downtown map. Apps are freaking lootly, we will. And we're going to keep exploring. Yeah, we're going to find our first. I don't know if this is a... Bloodsucker or Drain Demus? I can't remember. 
But he's dead now, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, we'll take the gunpowder. Hells yeah. Alright. Um, so... Potentially have some options here. We can go to the restaurant. Oh, there's a little locked door that way. That's to the restaurant. Let's check this way out first. Oh, there's another drain demos. Good thing we got our shotgun with us. Really? The dodge didn't work. We actually still got hit, even though we dodged. I wasn't aware that that was a thing that could actually happen, but okay. Right, so what does this need? I'm guessing it needs a battery or something. That, yeah, yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing we can't take the car battery. Because that would, you know, be too easy. Right. Oh, we're going to have to fight Nemesis through here, aren't we? Uh... Yeah, I think we are. Maybe. I'm sure Nemesis is through here. Well, I mean, I can hit... Oh, there's our... Well, there's Carlos. Oh, shit, we could have used the blue gem here as well, I think. Never mind. Fine. It's fine. There's the restaurant. Um... Let's go into the restaurant. Because there's other things in here as well. Oh. Okay. Is this not the way to the restaurant? Oh, there's actually... Oh, there's a save room there as well. Actually, let's, let's head towards the save room. Seems like that might be a good idea. That was not a decap attack. I am... Very disappointed in that. Well, let's see if we can't clear some of these guys. Switch that mag over, Jill, like a boss. Oh, you little dick. Actually, kind of a big dick move that was. There we go. Beautiful. You're an artist. Oh, there's always one left, isn't there? There's always one. Drop him to his knees. Nice. Always one left. God, what a dick. I've got a feeling... Nemi's going to turn up. Any minute. Got a pretty strong feeling Nemesis is going to turn up at any minute. Actually, uh, there's the cr oh, actually, we can use that. Is there nothing? Oh, there's some shotgun shells, so that's cool. We do like our shotgun shells in these parts. Keep that shotgun topped up because you never know when you're gonna bump into something pretty horrible. Right, let's drop you back. Let's. Uh, you know, let's actually use that gunpowder. We must be getting pretty close now to being able to uh, produce the good stuff. I think it's like, I don't know, seven or eight times before that happens. It's something like that. And no, we don't want to deselect the weapon. We also want to pick up the crank because crank yo. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Now we can get a couple of free hits on Nemesis. Um, now this one. Hmm. We'll hold on to it. For now. We're actually on like half an hour here. Well, no, we're not. We're on like 20 minutes. Uh, we will save it at the save room. Just because. Seems like the right thing to do. Uh, now, let's go... I think the best way through. Uh, so we've got the newspaper office there. Ah, that's the way to the trolley. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm pretty sure actually we don't meet. Let's go to the restaurant. No, we don't meet them all at the trolley, do we? We bump into them before that, if memory serves. Um, might be worth picking up some health. There might be some in here. We're going to have a bit of a rough time in Nemesis in a minute. I can smell them. Locked with a simple lock. Yes, we'll use the lock pick. That. Oh, I remember when Nemesis spawns. Yeah, I remember when Nemesis spawns. We can blow him up with this gas valve. Pretty sure he spawns when we touch that. Uh, right. Do can we like examine the gas or something? Yeah, because we can throw that lamp, or Carlos throws the lamp. The lamp is lit. One of them does anyway. Flammable gas is leaking. Now I can't remember if we blow Nemesis up. Does that count as a kill? I think it does. But we do need this because I think this is the next one. Yeah, this is the next one in line. City guide. So city guide. The tracks of our city. Dear citizens, thanks to kind and generous people of Umbrella Inc., this is a peaceful and friendly city. The vast donations from Umbrella Inc. have been used for welfare work, the construction of public utilities, and to help maintain public peace. In 1992, it was my fifth year as mayor of our beautiful city. It was then that through many donations and hard work, our city was able to rebuild the municipal building, create a state-of-the-art hospital in honour of these fine accomplishments i was awarded with a grand statue that same year this statue rests in the municipal building i came to the city an engineer more than 35 years ago i made contributions to the electrical systems and the installation of the cable car i pledged to follow the tradition of this fine city and will devote devote my life to its prosperity the mayor of the city michael warren all right michael i don't trust you I think you're in bed a little bit too deep with Umbrella. Now, yes, I thought there might be. Okay. Take the gunpowder A. Which is nice. And let's combine. There we go. Anything else? There doesn't appear to be health or anything, does there? Nothing suspicious. Okay. So I'm guessing we haven't met Carlos yet for a reason. What I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to go back and I'm going to save the game. Uh, let's go back to the save room, save the game, because, yeah, we'll leave it here. for We're on like 23 minutes anyway. Uh, and time is ever so precious this week. So, and then we're going to have a little think about what we're going to do, what our next play is going to be, if you will. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.